It's time for another nickel hunt and fill. We have a damaged one. Let's take a look at that one first. And it's a 2004. It's bent. We got a 1963 Denver. This one looks really old. It's a 1962. We got a 1966 Philadelphia. We got a 1960 Denver. We got a 1970 San Francisco. We got another 1970 San Francisco. And I see a 1941. We only need the 41 San Francisco. This is the 41 Philadelphia. Still another 1941 though. We got another 1941. This needs to be the San Francisco. Which it's not. It's another Philadelphia. This is a 1965 Philadelphia. A lot of older coins in this roll. We got a reverse Denver, and it's a 1964. We got another reverse Denver, and it's a 1962. We got another reverse Denver. This is another 1964. This one looks older too. It's a 1964. Almost missed this one. This is a 1963 Denver. We got a 1963 Philadelphia. We got another reverse Denver. It's a 1964. We have a 1965. The package damaged though. We got another reverse Denver. It's a 1964. But we have our first reverse San Francisco of the box. And probably only reverse San Francisco. We only have seven more rolls after this. So this is that reverse San Francisco. So I can zoom in to show you that S. It's a 1947. I think we need a San Francisco 47. We need a San Francisco. There's only 24.7 million of these minted. We got another 1964 Denver. In this book, we're going to be upgrading the 1962 Denver and the 1976 Philadelphia. And we're going to be adding the 1947 San Francisco. We got a 1964 Philadelphia. We got a 1967 Philadelphia. This is a 1964 Denver. We got a 1969 Denver. We got a 1953 Denver. We got a 1964 Denver. So on the placemat here is the 1953 D over D. This is my 1953. And if you look at the Denver mint mark, 
it looks like this doubling on the D. So that looks at the 1953 D over D. So I just pulled up PCGS for the 1953 D over D. It's the FS501. If I bring this up, you can see how it's doubled. One in MS66 sold for $541. Mine is not anywhere near Mint State. There's only three sold listings on PCGS. The cheapest one was MS65 at $144. The most expensive was MS66 at $541. Okay, I have no idea how this happened, but I just hunted two entire rolls without even recording. I am just gonna show you the coins that I pulled out. We got the Buffalo, a 1964, Denver, an off-center 1973, a 1982, a 1970, San Francisco, the Ocean and the View, a 1964, Denver, and an Ocean and the View. This is the last roll in the box. I'm hoping for silver... Bears, varieties, or another coin for the book. Well, that was a very anticlimactic last roll. The only coin that I'm keeping is this 2004 Denver. I'm going to go through all these one more time like I always do just to make sure I didn't miss anything. But if I didn't, this would be the end of the video. And I hope you enjoyed this. And now I'll be back with... Another nickel box very soon. Bye.